Welcome to module four. In this module, we're going to cover assignments and tests. These are the mostly frequently used tools in Blackboard for doing types of assessment. Assignments allows a lot of extra fun features that you can use, including the Safe Assign, which is a plagiarism detection tool. And Safe Assign is a little bit like putting on a pair of glasses where you can look at things a little more clearly, but you still have to make a judgment as to what to do with them. Also, it will assignments allows you to annotate in line so you can basically replicate the red pen, except maybe not with the red pen, so that you can identify pieces within the student's document that you want to draw attention to. And you can grade and you can use a rubric and there's also different types of feedback available in, in the assignments tool. The, t the test tool is one that's two step. So you create your test just like you do in your regular course site. And you basically, your test is like a document. And then, but you don't know where, when, or who this is going to. So phase two of your test is deploying it. So that is where you define who gets to see it, when they get to see it, conditions around it, if there are exceptions for students with disabilities who need extra time, or if they have a, uh, you need to have a student write it on a different day. So there's a lot of advantageous features in the test tool. Further, the test tool has um, ways of sharing automated feedback back with your students. They can see the score for those questions that automatically grade. They can see feedback on those questions. For example, if they got a question wrong, you can point them to a part in your course site where they can get the right answer. So you can use tests as a formative and summative uh, tool. Tests can also be used for things like basically replicating a form where you wanna ask people individually to respond to something. So you can use an essay type question or you can use a short answer question to get feedback and then you can see who answered in which manner. The survey tool on the other hand allows you to do, uh, you know that somebody's completed something but you don't know what their results are. So the, what we're gonna do is we're gonna walk you through creating assignments and accessing the student si assignment submission this is a great place for that student preview user that I talked about earlier for you to find out what they do and don't see. And then you're going to be able to provide them feedback with that. Then you're going to be able to create a test, accessing the student test submissions, some advanced functionality in the testing, like you can actually grade by question. You can see a lot of statistics available in the tests, and it's a very robust tool if you know how to use it properly. Finally, you'll be completing this module by doing a quiz, which is a test. So enjoy the module and keep working. Remember to try it out in your sandbox.